Hootsuite tutorial for beginners. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we'll be taking a quick look at how you can get started with Hootsuite. So let's get into it. Now, Hootsuite is a platform that enables you to manage your social media and increase your overall social media performance. You have automated inboxes and a lot of different management tools, as well as the fact that you can manage multiple different social media platforms all in one space. Now, this is something that you need to have for a growing business if you're looking to start your business and you're trying to get, you know, on track with all of your social media, then Hootsuite is a great option. You can create, you know, your content, you can plan your content, you can schedule it as well. And it is a very effective way to get your brand name out there. So to get started, all you need to do is head on over to Hootsuite.com. Once you are on Hootsuite.com, you just want to click on start your free trial over here. Then you're going to choose what you want. So if you want it just for yourself or if you want the team plan, I want it for me. On the just for me version, you have 10 social media accounts that you can link as well as only one user. But if you have multiple different users, you can use the team plan, which has three users and 20 social media accounts that you can manage simultaneously. Now we're going to do the individual one. And the best part about this is that you can get a 30 day free trial or if you skip your trial, you can get a 20% discount on Hootsuite as well. But we're going to click on start your 30 day free trial over here. And from here, we're just going to enter some basic information. And after that, you're going to just click on create my account. Then you have your annual or monthly billing, whatever you want to add. And I will just enter my information and I'll get back to you guys in one second. So once you have completed entering your basic payment information, you can continue on and you don't have to worry, you'll get your 30 day free trial. And then after that, you will start getting charged. So after that, you will have to enter the industry that you are in. So let's say we are in other and you can add what you are in. Let's say we're in commerce. Then after that, you're going to add how many employees are currently working under your company. Now, after that, you have to do one of the most essential steps of Hootsuite, which is to link your social media account. So you have multiple different options. We have Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, TikTok, LinkedIn, and Pinterest. So let's say we want to get started with maybe Twitter, and we're just going to link our profile over here. And then once the ownership is completed, you're going to just add the ownership like this. Then you can add your Instagram, let's say, and then you would just enter your Instagram uh, or Facebook information to connect to the Meta Business Suite. But I think I want to continue with YouTube first like this. And now you guys can see I've added two different social media platforms. Now, after that, I will just click on next over here to get started with Hootsuite. So once you add your social media, you can just click on let's go. And this will load up Hootsuite. So this is the Hootsuite dashboard. As you guys can see, on the top left, you get your home icon, which is our little Hootsuite L. Then you have your plans. Then you have your create section. Now, your create section is basically what allows you to, in an instant, create a new post, beauty video, pin, or any of your social media platforms. You can click on clear account and select the social media account that you want to use to post on. And then you have the content. Now, depending on the type of content you have, uh, if it's Instagram, you're going to have a file. You're going to have to mandatorily add a picture. You can enter your content, images, links over here as well. You also can create a media library in your uh, specific Hootsuite account. And you can add all of your images, all of your brand images, so they are easier to access. You also can design with Canva as well. Now, once you have your post created, you can choose to post now or you have the save draft button and you can post and reuse account as well as post and duplicate. But the best option is obviously schedule for later and you can basically create your entire content schedule using this method. So after that, if we take a look at creating YouTube videos, how can you really do that with Hootsuite? Well, just go back into your create section. Click on YouTube video and you can just upload any file. Let's just go for example. So let's just say we want to upload this file. Now you will get the title. Obviously, we're going to change that. You're going to enter the title of your YouTube. So you can enter whatever you want. You have your description, tags, your category, the 
privacy as well as scheduling. So uh, once your upload is completed, you can choose to schedule this as well. And this will allow you to not only manage your social media, but to even manage your entire content scheduling on YouTube, which is in itself a premium feature that you don't get access to on a lot of other platforms. So this is one great thing to have as well. Now, if you take a look at the next section on your navigation panel, you have a basic search option, then you have a inspiration option. Now, what is the inspiration option? Well, they have currently created the Oli AI Writer, and this is basically where you can repurpose old topics, start from scratch, get inspired, you can turn web content into posts, as well as get your holiday calendar ready. So you can choose any upcoming holiday and create captions for your celebratory posts. Or you can even just get more ideas to promote and generate campaigns for your social media content. Because we all know that the primary function for social media is marketing. For a lot of businesses, a lot of institutions, the marketing is probably one of the major reasons why you're using social media and you're trying to focus on social media. So it's very essential that you use these tools to simplify a lot of that, you know, difficult work. So you guys can see there are amazing little captions they have generated. You can also go back into the all section and you have throwback Thursday, Y2K nostalgia, how it's made, flashback Friday, introduce an employee, show off our space, you know, they're going to provide you with the ideas that you can use to generate social media content which is something you're not going to find in any other scheduling tool or social media management tool. Usually those are just focused on creating a calendar for your social media posts, but they're not really helping you in creating your posts. However, Hootsuite is a all-in-one that can really help you in uh, stepping up the social media content that you do have. Now, just taking a look at some of the ideas that you can get with Hootsuite. Let's say we want to create a monday motivational post so you can just click on use this idea and it will generate a post for you depending on what kind of content you are creating you guys can see they have even created a image based post you have captions you also have all of the content the images and you can add your own branding to that as well and that can be a great way to have synced up posts on multiple social media platforms so you guys can see it says publish to this account and you can add social account and publish on multiple different accounts all together to be able to do successful brand launches or successful campaigns with this kind of social media platform now Moving on to the next section, we also have the stream section. So the stream section allows you to take a look at all of your board. You can see all of the content that is coming in, what you're following, what is your published commentary, your moderation information, you know, all of your basic information that you would require is going to be present over here. Your Twitter feeds, your subscribers, followers, scheduled content, and your current or pre-existing tweets. And then you have your planner, which is basically going to show you all of the content you have planned ahead. So you can view it by monthly and you can even view it as a list. So you're able to see all of the content that is scheduled or weekly or monthly. And you can also do post status. You can also do social accounts so you can filter it out by a specific social media account that will help you in seeing, okay, so I'm posting every other day on Twitter and I'm posting maybe daily on YouTube, so on and so forth. Now, moving on, then you have a basic little inbox on Hootsuite, which is going to be filtered out by the platform. So you have your Twitter mention, you also have, you know, uh, Instagram, you also have, depending on how many social media accounts, you're going to find all of their inboxes over here. You can click on settings on the bottom left and you can also allow notifications so you are able to reply as soon as possible. Now, moving on to the next section, you have advertisements. So... If you are someone that is using Google ads, Instagram ads, Facebook ads, then this is going to be a good section for you. If you are not, you can just skip this and move directly to analytics. Now in your analytics section, you're going to find there are multiple different reports that you can generate. So you have uh, the new report section and you can just click on that and you can see the different categorizations you have. You have providers, you have audience growth, you have your brand awareness as well as post reach. You can also do conversion based reports as well as engagement based reports depending on what you are focusing on. 
if I have a new brand, then I'm going to be focusing on awareness and I would need more reports regarding that. If I'm someone that has established their brand and it's been a while and now I'm just looking to, um, you know, make money, then I would look for a conversion. And you can do this with, you know, multiple different social media accounts and get detailed reports on each individual account. So in this way, you can really upgrade your social media content with Hootsuite. And I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And I will catch you guys in the next video.